Everybody, this is Jason from LeanBodyMovement.com. Do you get six hours or less of sleep on the average per night? If you do, you want to watch this video. Cool. So once again, if you get less than about six, maybe five or even less than six hours of sleep per night, which it seems like more and more, I hear about more people um, getting less than six hours of sleep, some less than five, which uh, the, the statistic that I saw that it was 30% of Americans, but I thought it's a lot higher than that. I thought it was between actually 40 and 50. But that's just me, and that's what I see with my clientele. So people that come to me beforehand. So basically what I want to do is just share with you a few things, a few reasons why you want to fight, like literally fight to get your at least uh, pushing seven hours of sleep, if not eight. Um, number one, I think it's safe to say that most people know this. I hope you know it by now. But it just, number one is that overall, people that sleep at least seven hours or get more sleep, they live longer. You know, in retrospect, or conversely, people that sleep get less sleep or lack of quality of sleep, uh, they live less. And they also experience higher incidence of cancer and just overall sickness, virus, things like that. And their immunity goes way down. I know you know that, but I wanted to point that out because it's also going to have a huge effect on your ability to gain lean athletic muscle. Lose that because the less sleep you get, it's actually now research proven and scientifically proven through kind of avatars and through autopsy that cortisol actually shoots sky high. Uh, when you are kind of lack of sleep. So cortisol, stress hormone, goes way up. Your testosterone is going to go way down, and both men and women need a good level of testosterone. So those are going to affect a lot of things. Your insulin production. They're going to affect leptin, which is basically uh, kind of your fat-burning hormone. Ghrelin, which makes you, you know, craving, basically. Ghrelin is craving. So think of it as that. Um, so it's going to affect all those hormones. In fact, so many things, um, I mean, just, you just feel, I mean, how do you feel when you are consistently getting like five, four, eight hours of sleep, or even a couple of days, a week like that. So, keep those in mind. If you need anything, let me know. Comment below, and we'll see you guys real soon.